What is up, guys? We are back with some more Nexomon Extinction, and we're here to battle this uh, Tamer here. Whoa, you scared me. What's your problem, huh? You want to fight me, huh? No, no we, we don't. <laughs> A fight it is, then, you creeps. Oh, I'm the creep? I'm cracking up because my, uh, <laughs> my friends ain't shit right now, guys. Uh, <laughs> they just cropping my, <laughs> my face now and sending it to me. <laughs> But all right, Ductar. The deck is probably like a little OP right now since it looks like everything is around like early 10s. 10 to 15. Oh, okay. The next three ghost type skills have 100% accuracy. I don't, I don't care about that actually. I'm like we, we, we hit everything pretty well. Oh no, please let me go. I'll stop picking fights. I swear. If you say so. So what I'm gonna do now? Um, I think I'll set you as the main. And. Since you can, like I said, you can take these cores off, apparently. See, I was having it boost its EXP from, like, these fights. Yeah, we'll, we'll do this instead. And then... I do want you to get EXP, just because I like the way Croncho just looks. Oh, we're right here at the house, too. Who would have thought? Okay, we got a revive. What else? Like, there's nobody in here but this chest? A greed wallet. What? The heck's a greed wallet? Having this... Item in your inventory causes battles to yield 10% more coins. Oh, snap. That's actually pretty convenient. So I don't see anybody here to like even talk to or interact with. That's weird. Um, let me go to the journal and see. Follow the path south from the orphanage until you find the citadel. Oh, okay, so that's what I'm supposed to be going to the citadel? My bad, skis. So, it has to be this way then, right? Well, at least I went in there and got that greed wallet. That's looking like that's going to be extremely clutch. Okay, here we go. Stop! Who are you? Eek. Get off me, guild tamers. You ran into me. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> Somebody help me. <laughs> I like how he's sweating too. He's like, oh, oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Why didn't you stop the thief? What What did she take from you? Hmm. I forgot. Oh, hello there. My name is Liam. What's up? The, the thief. What did she take from you? What thief? Say, have you guys seen a letter I dropped around here? So the thief stole your letter. <laughs> what letter? Bro, what? <laughs> By the way, have you seen a letter dropped around here? A thief took your letter. What letter? By the way, have you seen a... Let's just find this guy's letter, Blaze. That thief must be somewhere in the city ahead. What letter? Okay, I like how they did that. It, it, it honestly most likely pissed the hell off of uh coco piss coco the hell off 
You just received an optional quest. You can track side quests in your journal. Quests like this aren't necessarily led to the story, so you don't have to do them. But I thought all side quests were kind of like optional. This is nice. The Immortal Citadel. This place is known as the Immortal Citadel. Centuries ago, a witch's curse turned the people of a small town into wisps. The curse was never lifted and the number of ghosts kept on rising. Most of them got used to it and have normal lives, while others have gone totally mad. Thank you, Coco. Well said. We gotta find that psychic to examine your artifact. I heard that there's some kind of marketplace around here. I wonder if they sell things that you could find can't find anywhere else. Yeah, that'd be pretty convenient, right? Can I go in here? Appears to be locked. Okay. I came all the way here to understand the curse that afflicts these folks. I guess now it's like we just go in. Dang, everybody's a ghost out here? Or a wisp, as they like to call it. A wisp. Wisp, wisp, Registering you, my guy. There's lots of shinies out here. So I guess we'll go in here and see what's up. Anything other stairs? Up and there's a quest. There's the thief, actually. Did you follow me all the way here? We just want the letter back, thief. I'm no thief. The name's Hannah. Shouldn't you guys be fighting tyrants or whatnot? This letter's mine, so get lost, punks. What level are your Nexomon? Oh, okay. Okay, you did more damage than I kind of wanted you to do. And then we miss. Okay. Well, we'll send Woozy out. Okay, this was not the switchings we were supposed to be doing. Uh, sir. <laughs> sir. Ma'am, I mean, ma'am, I'm sorry. Demotivate. Dang. At least that missed. Are you sure that's the switch out you want to do? Okay, yeah, you're you're pretty confident in that switch out. The fact that Croncho just hits so freaking hard. Can I have speed? Yeah. Mega Lavinu. I don't know what that is, but we're gonna switch in Hedeka. And we're gonna... Wow, I chose Glare. Did not mean to choose Glare. Soul Vendor. Oh wow, that took out all its health. Even better. Oh, look at that. Everybody got a good amount. Onin leveled up. What the I didn't even check to see what level Onin evolves at. Mm. You're gonna pay for that. Okay, Hannah. Okay, at least we got the stolen letter. We got the letter. We should bring it back to that guy. I hope that he's still there. Yeah, that was, that was nice, quick and easy. Is there not like a... A little center here for me to heal up at though what do you have poor fellows can you imagine being cursed into a wisp for centuries hey blaze let's cheer them up with the banquet marvelous pastries and the finest meats you're not thinking this through are you yeah i don't even have all that locked door locked door everything's just locked out here is this an extension of the city? I don't 
don't know. Like, I'm kind of hoping I'm going the right way. Okay, maybe I came here too early and kind of just, like, spoiled something for the story for myself? I don't know. That was weird. We'll just go north. <laughs> okay, he doesn't look crazy at all. Hey, who goes there? Elisa's man manner is off limits. Elisa, is that the psychic of this place? Lady Elisa told me to only allow people who could guess her very secret number. Only then may you enter. Alright, I suppose we can do that. It is between 1 and 10 million. Good luck. Excuse me? <laughs> Go ahead, kid. Try to guess the number. Uh, Y'all tripping. Tripping, tripping. What? How am I supposed to know this? Like... I'm going to say five. Nah. Do I say it? Because her name has five. So, yeah. We'll just... I don't know. They're tripping with this. Guessing. Like, I know this is BS. This has to be part of the story. Impossible. That's exactly right. The number was five. Are you kidding me? You may enter at least a minute. <laughs> Please go ahead, friends. My name is Alfred, by the way. Wait, what? Maybe you are the psychic one, Blades. Possibly. Thunder Shark, sweet, sweet. Okay, we got an exo trash for days. Tempest Shark, yep, yep. So one thing I found cool was uh, you can make cores and give them to your Nexomon. So I'm probably going to make a bunch to either boost the XP or let them get a percentage out like after battles. It's awfully quiet in here, don't you think? Too quiet. Oh, that was cue for me to start moving around. I'm sorry. I did not know. <laughs> oh, sweet and orange. 20 coins. Looks like the psychic's dead. Oh, hello, Blades. How are you liking this accursed place? Lots of tamers come here to catch psychic type and ghost type Nexamon. You should get some too, buddy. You know, I've always wanted to become a tamer just like you guys. Huh? What's stopping you? Well, I can't buy a Nexo trap because the marketplace owner is a talking dog. He creeps me out. I hate dogs. They're the worst. Of course. I understand, Alfred. <laughs> Tell you what. Blades and I will get some Nexo traps for you and then you can become a tamer. Really? That would be amazing. You two are the best. I'll be right here getting my hopes up. Okay. <laughs> Let's get him a few Nexo Trap Blades. It's the least we can do for a character who was lazily recycled. Wow. Ten Nexo Traps? Okay. I think I have ten. Yeah. As I was just saying, I have Nexo Traps for days. I give this guy ten. But one cool thing is that we're going to get that EXP booster and those stacks. So you can get bunch of those to try to um increase the amount of exp that you get from battles so this is like a passive like item that you just hold in your bag wow you brought these traps for me thanks to y'all become an actual tamer now i need to learn how to fight with nexomon <laughs> how about we meet on the fields to the east there's lots of room to teach me come on he didn't pay us back for the nexo traps oh well at least he seems pretty excited about becoming a tamer Let's meet him outside the city, Blades. Yeah, I was about to say the same thing. I'm like, he didn't even pay us. But we'll get to that later. Because now it's time for the psychic. Hello, Blades. I've been expecting you and your pet. You must be Eliza. Yep, the bestest psychic in the world. She's just a kid. How can we know if she's the real deal? Psst. I knew that you'd guess five. You want to try the tyrant of life. Someone tried to kidnap you. We live inside a Nintendo Switch. <laughs> Wait, was that... What was the last one? <laughs> Some bandits tried to kidnap you? Okay, so what can you tell us about this artifact? Oh, I know everything about the tyrant of life. But I can't help you right now. Nay, you've been through my city. Did you notice anything strange? Anything strange in a cursed city full of ghosts? Gee. I'll cut to the chase then. Just when you fools arrived, wild Nexomon started going berserk all over my city, wreaking havoc. This place is literally built on top of a Nexomon graveyard. What else did you expect? 
How is this our fault? There is no such thing as a coincidence, Dimwit. This is your doing. You want my counsel? Fix what you caused. Three monsters. Chop, chop. Let's look around the city and see if we can help somehow. For strange spirits? Well, like... Alright, let's see now. At least I said that there are three necks I'm on going rampant. Okay. Are we able to go this way? What's wrong with that neck I'm on? Can someone stop him? I'm not a tamer. Do I have to find a way over there? Yeah, I can't even walk through ghosts. That doesn't make sense to me. I don't know. Does that make sense to you guys? Um, actually, what I'm about to do is warp, uh, what was it, to the city, heal up, and warp back. <laughs> That's the convenience of that, actually. And if it's Ghost, I guess I might as well just start it off with, uh, Hideka. Okay, well, I can't go that way. <laughs> My guy's like, what the heck is this? Ah, blades. Yes, blades. I know your little secret blades. What is that thing talking about? We don't have any secrets. You may have fooled everyone else, but not me. I can see. I can see through your dark schemes, Blades. Well, we don't even have, like, a level for this thing? Let's clear you first. Yep, we got a leech on. Give me that back. I like how it gave us like a question mark for its level. That was pretty weird, huh? He just talked as if you were super evil or something. <laughs> Which you are not, right? Let's see. It seems like we aren't done yet. At least that there are three incidents going on in the Mortal Citadel. Let's keep looking. Okay. Have you seen the uh, witch camp to the west? They sell high quality potions. That place is too creepy. Can I ask you to fetch some of their potions? I will pay for them, of course. Okay. Well, let me get these sparkles first. A greed core. What does a greed core do? Oh, increases the amount of money. Okay. Yeah, we'll put that on because uh, your boy definitely is going to need money. The marketplace is under attack. Help! I can't do business with that thing over there. Huh? You're going to fight? Alright, go. I'm counting on you. Good luck. You can do it. Oh, this one didn't say anything. I'm not gonna get that that leech off. That was that's something I was hoping I'd get.
You did it. You saved my business. Please take these. They should aid in your adventures. Okay, got some ghost nexo traps. Those are powerful nexo traps designed to capture ghost type nexomon. I'm sure that you'll find them useful. Stay safe now. Let's see. It seems like we aren't done yet. Okay, you're just going to keep repeating that until I get the job done. That saved me time instead of having to go back. Uh, did I already talk to this person? You can reach the soul instead of having to use. It's dangerous but quite rich with elemental charge. I actually got myself way more than I needed. Yeah, I'll take him. I'll most likely check out these houses another time. What if this girl's like, after we defeat everything, it's gonna be like, oh, that was just a test. Is that a monkey? It looks like a Digimon. <laughs> what Digimon was that? Uh, from Digimon World 3, it was like one of like the starter Digimon. Stay back. Stay back, you foul monster. You think I'm afraid of you? Take this. Uh, you may be stronger, but I can still outrun you. The developers of this game must be on a tight budget. <laughs> wow. What are you two waiting for? Help me. Glare is always great to start off with. I don't know why I use Glare on the ghost. I just remembered it doesn't even work on, on ghosts and psychic types. Ooh, thought something happened. The way the music just cut off like that. I'm too old for this. Good job, my friend. The name's Ron. That monster was tormenting me when I was still active. Oh, we got a vault key. What's that? Oh, haven't you heard of Spencer's Fortune? Centuries ago, a very rich tamer built nine underground vaults across the world. You need keys like this one to open them. The vaults contain all manner of rare treasures. Not really useful to me anymore, of course. Are you telling us to go ransack some dead guy's treasure? I can take the key back if you don't want it. No, we're good. <laughs> That's the spirit. If I'm not mistaken, there's one such vault hidden somewhere in a cave to the east of the Immortal Citadel. Good luck, kids. Maybe we'll meet again. A cave to the east, huh? Might be worth checking out some. Let's see. Oh, I think we've resolved all the incidents. We should talk to Eliza. The time, this time she'll help us for sure. Yeah. So... That's so we're assuming. Welcome back, and well done. Are you gonna help us now? We need to learn about this artifact. Tihi, did you heal your neck, Saman? What? Let me restore your party real quick. Oh, she wants to battle us? Thanks, I guess. What's going on? Listen up, Blades. Somebody is coming to kidnap you again, so brace yourself. Wait, what? Eyes forward, fools. Okay. Sh shouldn't we just leave? We could just leave. Let them come, alright? I mean, I guess. <laughs> we got him now, boys. Well done. Oh, so that small fry is blazed. That's the boss's target? Yes, sir. I remember him from the orphan, and she's not strong enough to beat you. Of course not. I can't believe that you lost to someone like that. It's just no matter. I will finish what you guys started. You made us wait for them? <laughs> what? What is wrong with you? <laughs> Oh, relax. You can handle this one. <laughs> Think again, brat. I've never failed, my lord. I will take blades to him. We gotta run. He seems way stronger than that orphanage bandit. Shush, kitty. Who is the psychic here? Fight him. I mean, if you say so. 
exactly. That looks like I can take you out with Hideka, no problem. Oh, ma <laughs> Masquat. So this is like the psychic starter that you could choose from. It's evolution, I think. But how did you get it at 14? That's what I'm not understanding. Huh, you're gonna be a problem. Got the leech. I'm just like now realizing like how much, uh, how many Nexa money had Ripa, <laughs> Ripa, Grima. Okay. This one looks pretty dope. Onin leveled up and wants to learn Super Slam. Oh, you already. Oh, and you're evolving. Look at that. I guess it's a good idea that I put that EXP like share thing on it. Okay, that Peltry. That looks pretty dope. I keep saying dope a lot. You guys are probably like, wow, he just keeps saying that. Everything looks dope in this game, guys. I I don't understand. Minions, you told me that Blades was weak. I swear that he wasn't that strong back then. Something's different. Tis, tis, tis. Petty clown, you are but a puppet in a grand play of mine. Okay. What have you done, witch? Let's just say that I gave Blades some training. I released several wild Nexmon to the city and then forced Blades to fight them one by one. Wait. You sent those Nexomon rampant? And now you're much stronger because of it. You're welcome. I'm not even sure who's the villain here. This isn't over. I won't fail, my lord. I'll be back, I swear. And you'll lose again. Take my word for it, fool. Okay, so she gave us some training that we didn't know was supposed to be our training. Good gracious. Even with my clairvoyance, I wasn't sure if you'd win. You do look like a small fry after all, Blades. Why is everyone trying to kidnap Blades? How can you be so oblivious? Come on, show me that artifact of yours. Goodness, I never thought that I'd see this with my own eyes. Well, how is this old thing related to the Tyrant of Life? Hmm, how blind of you. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Tyrant of Life itself, fools. It's not a relic, it's an egg. Oh. That's not what my character looks like. <laughs> you mean that Tyrant will hatch from this thing? Precisely. The so-called Tyrant of Life is but a myth, a bedtime story, but now you have the means to make it a reality. You've met Atlanta, haven't you? The woman found an egg as well, and it hatched to that powerful Nivalis. So we can have our very own Tyrant. Yes, you can technically create a Tyrant all for yourself. How very exciting. Are you interested? Are you kidding? Of course we are! How do we hatch the egg? Great question. The first step is to nourish it with elemental power. And for that, you need to visit a very peculiar kind of shrine, a, a ley line, as some people call it. There's plenty of shrines across the world. There's one in the city of Ignitia, for example, <laughs> raising a tyrant. The guild would hate to hear that. But that's your own decision, Blade. If you really want to hatch that egg, find the elemental shrine in Ignitia. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to fix my window. I will send you guys the bill later. What do you, what did, what do you say, Blades? Getting your own tyrant sounds amazing, but it will be difficult. We could head east to Ignitia, as she said, or do some quests around here. Hey, don't forget your reward for saving my city from those ghosts. You don't deserve it, of course, but my foolish people wanted to pay you back somehow. It's fine with me. But alright, guys, uh, I think I'm going to end this episode off here. As long as there's not a cutscene when I leave. Yeah. I think I'm going to end this episode off here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I'm not really sure what I want to do next. I want to follow the main story. Do I want to see what all I can find out here as far as ghosts and psychic types? 
but we'll see in the time to come but with that said guys leave a like for the video it helps out the video a lot and also subscribe to my channel it helps out the channel a lot with that said stay sharp later